So basically, I work with the University of Derby, I am, and there's a team of five human researchers, and then two, obviously, experienced researchers, or three, on any given day. And this is to basically give us as much uh, support as necessary, but also it's about the effectiveness and the impact EHCPs have on uh, young people and um, either negative or positive, and to see how the document just affects people. So it's a three-year project, and I we're on the second the second year now. Well, I used to work for an amazing organisation called Lincoln Young Voices, and that was about participation as well. Um, so then after that ended, we found out about this new project, and they're of a similar ilk. So it's all about participation here and young people's voice. Yeah. Well, I would say they're an incredible team with an amazing wealth of experience. And it is really good to get different people from different locali localities because obviously we're Lincolnshire based in general. Um, the only thing I would say to be aware of is making sure that it is accessible to all um, location wise as a lot of it goes from d goes on in Derby and Leicester, which obviously is quite a, a trek on a good day. So that's just something to be aware of, especially as we're doing a participation bit of work. So we'll do some online work as well. Um, but it's generally a really good project, and I hope that it makes a big impact. It's just that um, location is really big. I think the benefits for me, <laughs> on a serious level, learning how um, Lincolnshire works, because when you're in it, you don't see it, but when you go to the wider that community, as it were, you mm. see, oh, we're doing pretty well mm. as a, a county. Yeah. Whereas if you just were in those four walls, you would still think, yeah, there is a long way to go, but based on what we're trying to do, it's quite a, a learning curve. And also the the... Benefits for me are that we're a local team of lovely young researchers. Yes, I do get paid, which is always good because obviously, if you were doing that sort of thing voluntary, then it would be quite an undertaking. Well, I'm hoping that it will have a really positive one. I'm hoping that it will show. Um, different elements to what we expect because I know obviously we all have different opinions and what we uh, believe and so far the research is showing different things mm -hmm. so there's been a, a shocking I would say shocking but it's quite unique so that EHCPs are n not not important because they are obviously from a um, professional point of view but there is a strong link to the fact that young people don't put as much emphasis on them. Once the support is in place, that's all that matters. Mm -hmm. And that should be a bit. And also the fact that um, once people have moved from different schools, it seems to improve. Well, I would say it teaches you stuff, it, st as, in, to, as in the negative and the positive. So I know how I would. Um, how it works to run a team now, like a more in-depth team rather than just two of us, like it was at Lincoln Hill Voice, if that makes sense. Yep. It also teaches you that things take time longer than you think. So if you're thinking you can do things in an hour, you better add another one on because it's not going to be as quick because you need to get people's views. That is the whole point of it. And I think sometimes... Um, if you're too quick, then you've got to let everybody um, have a say if that makes sense. Yeah, the, that's the whole point. So the whole point is to try and get as much co-production as humanly possible um, and have as much impact as your researchers. I think the main thing is to have a good team behind you. Yeah. You've got to be aware that 
um, things take time. Yeah. Uh, but also, that if you get the views, that is the main aim. Yeah. And that if you don't want it to feel like, oh, we're just here for a jolly, that makes sense. There's got to be a purpose. Please let there be a purpose for every bit of research because otherwise it's just literally a jolly. Yeah. And also, what I'm going to say is location. If you're going to get... <laughs> Young people or disabled young people to do research, please put logistics in place because it makes it a lot less stressful if they know, right, it's every month and here we go. And all we can do it um, on teams has got to be options to make it easier because life is hard enough as it is in the nicest possible way and you don't really want to have extra pressure. Does that make sense? But yeah, I would say enjoy it, make the most of it. Do it million people which is kind of the point yeah but just be careful under the logistics be fair